Reconnect with the power of water together with the Lady of the Lake. Hello and welcome to the Galactic Channel. My name is Inge van Stralen and I am a Galactic Priestess. I help you reconnect with galactic wisdom and embody that wisdom so you can recreate heaven on earth. And I do that through one-on-one sessions, workshops, videos and meditations, online programs, and the Pleiadian Lightwork Temple Training. And if you're interested in working with me, check out the links in the description box below. And I have also included a link to my newsletter. So make sure to subscribe to my newsletter. And while you're at it, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Give this video a like and to share it with others. Okay, and that's all the practical stuff over and done with. Now let's get to the good stuff. And it's been a while since I have posted a video here And yeah, life happened. (laughs) And this amazing pilgrimage, Awakening New Avalon, happened. And we went on this incredible soul-led journey uh, in England, in Glastonbury, Stonehenge, Avery, and, you know, many more places. And it was so incredible. It was mind-blowing, so uplifting, community-building experience. So I am happy to still embody that frequency and to share it with you. And the Lady of the Lake is also connected to all these stories about Avalon. And it's actually a really beautiful being, um, very high frequency ascended master energy that is connected to the waters. And she is also connected to Lady Nada, the ascended master. So there is this direct lineage that direct information frequency that is coming through. And the Lady of the Lake wants us to reconnect with water in a new way, to connect with the essence of water and to connect with the consciousness of water because water is has its own consciousness and it's this frequency where this is it has this essence that is ever changing ever transforming and in that sense you know it has this incredible power of transformation and not just that it also has this power of connecting you through dimensions. So you can use water to connect with other dimensions because it's a conductor as well as a as a power of transformation. And we have that ability in us, in our physical body. And it's actually not surprising, you know, once you realize that our bodies are created out of water and, you know, consist of, I think, 70% water. So we carry that power of transformation within us, within our bodies, and that power of connecting to other dimensions. We have that within us, within ourselves, within our blood. And we are going to reconnect with that power, that power of transformation and open up our bodies. And in order to do that, the Lady of the Lake 
is asking us to reconnect with the essence of water, to be grateful for the essence of water, the consciousness of all the waters on this planet. So she's asking us to reconnect with that essence. And then, you know, send our gratitude and our love and respect to that water. And once we have recreated a new sense of connection with water, we can access that power within us and we can take in that power, that renewed power, that gratitude, love and connection within us. And the Lady of the Lake is also the one who gave Excalibur to Arthur. And Excalibur can also be, be seen as the sword of truth. So it has the power to cut through illusions, cut through fear, and actually shed a light on anything that is not light or not truth. So in that sense, also, the sword of truth, Excalibur, is a very powerful transformational tool. And the Lady of the Lake is going to use the frequency of Excalibur for us to help us transform the frequency of water within us. Okay, are you ready to do this? And... You know, it's going to be slightly different because I am going to ask you while you, you know, make yourself comfortable, you know, make sure that you're not interrupted for about 15 minutes. I am going to ask you to get a glass of water or, you know, it can be a new mug or whatever you would like to have your water in. Just a container of water. And it has to be, well, either tap water, filtered water, spring water, but it you have to be able to drink it. So we are going to send love and gratitude to this water and through this water to all the waters on the planet, to the consciousness, water consciousness, and then we're going to drink it. So maybe you'd like to pause the video, grab a glass of water, and then come back. While you're at it, you know, while you're moving about, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, give this video a like, and share it with others. All right. Welcome back with your water. And we're going to start, as always, by focusing on our bodies. And we do that by taking a couple of deep breaths. Breathe in and breathe out. Feel your body. Fill your body with breath. And on your exhale, you release whatever is ready to be released. Breathe in and breathe out. and ground yourself. If you're familiar with Pleiadian light work, put down your grounding cord through your first or second chakra, all the way to the light heart of Mother Earth, the Earth Star Crystal, or use your own technique for grounding. And if you don't have a technique just yet, breathe into the soles of your feet and the tip of your tailbone, and grow root from the soles of your feet and the tip of your tailbone, deep, deep into Mother Earth. And whatever method you're using, breathe into your grounding cord, breathe into your roots. And breathe in through your grounding cord, through your roots, breathe in Earth energy into your body. Fill your body with earth energy.
I call upon the Pleiadian emissaries of light and I ask them to join us in our individual spaces and to clear our individual spaces and to place a protective circle around our individual spaces and then to connect all our spaces together so that we're all in one big energetic circle. And I call upon Archangel Michael of light and love and I ask him to seal our space with the sword of truth. And I set the intention that we will use this meditation and activation for our spiritual growth in love, in light, in truth, and purity. So be it, so be it, so be it. And I call upon the higher council of light of the Dolphin Star Temple and I ask them to transform our circle into a sacred Dolphin Star Temple circle. And I ask them to place the pillars, the crystalline pillars around our circle, connecting us to the light heart of Mother Earth and the Dolphin Star Temple and the light heart of Father Son. Pleiadian, Syrian, and Andromedan emissaries of light ask for the following cones of light to be placed above and below our auras and above and below this temple space, the interdimensional, the evolutionary, the intergalactic, and the earth cones of light. And I welcome the Lady of the Lake in our circle, in our sacred temple space. And she brings her frequency and fills our circle, our temple space with her energy. And open your heart. She's asking for you to open your heart and to breathe into your heart and to release whatever is ready to be released from your heart. To open your heart to love, truth, light, and purity. And she stands in front of you. And from her heart, She sends a beautiful beam of love, light, truth, and purity to your heart and receive it. Open your heart and breathe in deep, deep into your heart and find a spark or a flame of love, light, truth and purity that burns in your heart and breathe into it and by breathing into that spark into that flame you feed the flame you feed that spark so it can grow and grow and grow and the lady of the lake helps you with this. And really feel that flame, that spark in your heart. And now take your glass or container of water and hold it in your hand. And focus again on that spark, that flame of love, light, truth, and purity in your heart area. And let that love, light, truth, and purity, that flame, run from your heart, through your arms, 
through your hands into the water. And send that flame of love, light, truth and purity from your heart into the water. And connect with the water in the glass. Connect with the essence of that water that you're sending your flame to. Thank you, water. Send gratitude. Really connect with the essence of the water in the glass. Maybe you can feel the frequency of the water. See it, feel it, hear it, know that it is there. And how it absorbs your gratitude, your love, your light. Thank you. Thank you for being here. I see you. I love you. Thank you for this precious gift of water. And connect with the miracle of water of how it can constantly change. It changes form from liquid to a gas, back to liquid. It changes into an ocean, from an ocean to a cloud, into a raindrop. Constantly changing and changing, feeding us, feeding and holding our planet, feeding and holding our bodies, sustaining our bodies. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And the Lady of the Lake, places her hands over your hands. And runs her energy through your hands into the water. Changing the frequency of the water. higher dimensional water and feel the miracle that is water. Feel the gratitude. Thank you. Thank you, beautiful essence of water. I love you. I honor you. And the Lady of the Lake points Excalibur into the water and places the frequency of Excalibur in the glass of water that you're holding. And while this all happens, Keep on sending love from that flame in your heart, through your arms, through your hands, into the glass. And the Lady of the Lake points Exc Excalibur to your heart. And opens your heart through the Excalibur frequency.
so your heart is able to receive the frequency, the high frequencies of this water that we have activated. Thank you, water. Thank you, beautiful being. And now slowly start drinking the water. Take a sip. And feel how this water activates your body. Activates the water within your body. And take another sip in gratitude. Keep feeling the gratitude and the love and the miracle of this water. I feel you. And take a moment to feel the frequency change in your body, to feel how the water spreads through your body and how it affects all the cells. Keep drinking. And it just transfers its frequency to the liquid in your cells. Breathe in and out. And keep drinking until you're done. but consciously drink. Really stay present in your body, feeling the water filling you, activating you. You don't have to finish it if it's too much, if you had like a really big glass of water. But make sure you finish it within one hour after finishing this exercise. And now breathe into your body. Feeling all the fluids in your body responding to the new frequency. Feel the water within your body. Connecting you with all the waters in the world. Connecting you with the consciousness of water. Connecting you with the ability of transformation. Connecting you with the ability 
to travel through dimensions, to experience dimensions, different dimensions in your body. And the Lady of the Lake asks us to do this practice, to consciously connect with water, raise the frequency of the water in a glass and drink it every day for a week. Breathe into your body and release. And I thank the Lady of the Lake for her guidance, her frequency, her love and light. Thank you so much. And all the other beings that were here present with us today, Pleiadian, Syrian and Andromedan Emissaries of Light, Archangel Michael and the Dolphin Star Temple Higher Council of Light. Thank you so much. And I ask to take away all the energetic structures so that we're all in our own energetic space again. Thank you so much. And breathe in and out. And open your eyes when you're ready. I can feel this in my body. Wow, what a difference. I am definitely going to do this every day for a week. Are you with me? Let me know your experience. This is a big experiment for me too. So let me know your experience here in the comments. And I look forward to seeing you again soon. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel, give this video a like, and to share it with others. See you next time. Bye-bye.